Skiboy with your first alert weather. Well, it was a beautiful start to the Memorial Day weekend. Just a little bit more cloud coverage than what we've seen over the past couple of days, but still didn't have to worry about any of the rain. But look at the nice colors kind of mixing in and out for your sunset. But so we've transitioned to nighttime looking in downtown Mobile. The towers are lit up red, white, and blue. Very fitting on this Memorial Day weekend. Very thankful for a lot of things. Very important to remember what this weekend's all about. So thank you to all those who have served. But absolutely picturesque scene coming in from downtown Mobile. And temperatures starting to cool off just a little bit. But not as quickly as we're used to seeing, especially within the last couple months. But right now, 76 in Mobile, 75 degrees. Back in Evergreen, Gulfport is sitting at 80 degrees still in past. Cagula sitting at 77 degrees, but when you factor in a dew point temperature that are into the lower 70s and upper 60s, that makes it feel downright humid outside, and that might lend to some patchy fog later on. So as we plan out the next 12 to 14 hours for you or so, temperatures nice and mild by tomorrow morning. We'll see temperatures around 70 degrees, patchy fog possible, and then it will introduce a very sliver of a chance tomorrow afternoon. But as we look at the bigger picture across the Gulf Coast, notice a lot of showers back in Mississippi and the Mississippi River Valley also make its way through Louisiana as those continue to slide our way. Those are going to continue to break apart, and rain chances for us are going to be staying on the low side. But if we venture a little bit further off to the east, there's some tropical things that we're starting to watch relatively closely. We have Tropical Depression 2 in the Atlantic. We already had Tropical Depression 1 in, the, in January, and that turned into Hurricane Alex. But there is a tropical storm warning for the coast of South Carolina. But we're, we're going to watch that, but not get any threat to the Gulf of Mexico. So you can see the spaghetti plots taking it through South Carolina. So it's getting to be about that time of year. But how that all plays out into our forecast is we'll start to see those showers as they move closer to us kind of wane. And we'll only introduce about a 10% chance of rain. Now, what I mean by that is we zoom things in here. Notice as we go throughout tomorrow afternoon, you only see a couple spotty showers. And that... And those showers kind of fade away towards the evening. Then we'll see some a little bit more Sunday afternoon. So bringing back the chance of a pop-up shower. So it won't be a washout. Just those pop-up showers will be possible. It might be a good idea just to keep the rain gear in the back of the car just in case. If you're headed to the beach tomorrow, we'll be breezy at times. Your Memorial Day forecast expecting temperatures near 90 degrees. Going to be hot, but a 20% chance of rain. As for tomorrow, highs will be, near, will be near 90 once again, but it will be on the muggy side. Southeast winds at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Your Memorial Day weekend looking pretty good. Highs near 90 degrees, feeling like summer, about a 20% chance of rain as we make our way through Memorial Day, but then looking like summer after that as well.